Okay, here we go with Luke um, hiding in his bed. Anakin this morning wanted out of the cage, so he came out and explored a little bit and is moving around. Luke is still hiding in his bed, and um, I gotta say that I just uh, am very attracted uh, to these cats, to cats like Luke that um, are desperately looking at you because they want to be all right. They want to be good cats. They want to be reassured everything's okay. Um, I guess maybe that's, you know, why I, my original field was special ed. Uh, being a teacher, um, I really wanted to work with sort of the, um, the ones that had a little bit of a tougher time. And uh, Luke is going to have a little bit of a tougher time, but he's making eye blinks, um, closing their eyes slowly when he looks at you. That's a sign of trust. Um, he's accepted some kisses on his forehead. And, uh, you know, he's just hoping that, that it's all going to be okay. And he just needs somebody who wants to spend some time reassuring him. And he'll bond very, very tightly with that person. You know, he's typical Siamese, so he's smart and he's curious and he's hopeful and all those things. But he's just, you know, been given too many reasons to kind of mistrust. And, of course, change is really the worst thing that, that cats like this can go through because it just makes things worse for them. And um, so we have to get him home. And we have to get him to a home that's going to give him plenty of time to adjust and is willing to work with him. You're going to keep him in a small area where you can access him and frequent, small, repeated, repeated, repeated soft touches and songs and love and kisses you know, is what's going to do it with this cat. And I think he's going to blossom pretty fast. I think people are going to be surprised, but he'll be a cat. The more you invest into him, the more you're going to get out. Um, and as I said in the first video, it's nicely balanced with the fact that Anakin will fulfill the, the more immediate cat needs, um, and Luke will be the one that uh, is, you know, makes you your heart feel good that you've done something good. Uh, for a real needy cat. Um, of course, Anakin is needy in his way, too, so, you know, it'll take, it'll take a lot of time for somebody. Somebody shouldn't adopt these pair, this pair unless they, you know, are up for it and have the time that they want to invest in it, because um, they're going to be more than just the cat. These are going to be cats that need attention. Um, and, you know, they'll give back 100% once someone invests a little bit of time to them. Luke, it's all right, buddy. You'll see. We'll find you the perfect home. We'll find you the perfect home, and you'll just be fine. Yes, you will. You will. You'll see. You'll see. It'll be okay. It'll be okay, buddy. So my job while they're here is lots of frequent um, but short bursts of gentle attention and uh, but but really my job is to get them home as soon as possible because the sooner they're in a home environment in a stable environment and starting to bond with people the better with their people you know they need stability but you can see he's got hope look at that and he's blinking it's gonna be okay <laughs>